Yes. Nice, I got mine two dollar snails too. No way. Yeah, 2018 for me. What? The best place to tune up the car? Like, how much does it cost to get all of this done? Um. going on guys hopefully everyone is safe and is doing well but in today's video i'm going to be talking about one of the most common questions i get on my channel and on social media is what's my pov setup to make these videos the pov stuff has been the bread and butter for my channel i really can't explain why these videos do so well i guess it's just the exhaust sound maybe it's relaxing to them it's asmr Believe it or not, it's actually super simple. Well, you really need three things, actually four things. First being the GoPro camera. Personally, I use the GoPro Hero 7. A must, a must, can't stress this enough, is having an ND filter. I'll show you guys in this video, um, test video, of what an ND filter is. Essentially, it does not over expose your image. Think of it like sunglasses for your camera. Next would be having a suction cup or suction mount to, you know, to a flat surface. And the last thing would be having a head mount. So I'll be leaving links to all these items in the video description below. I include them in every single video. And yes, I do make a small percentage. If you guys purchase these items, you know, the price is not inflated. It's at list price. I get a small percentage and that helps fund the channel and it allows for me to make these kind of videos. This lineup is crazy. extra microphones needed all you need to do is just use the built-in microphone again make it as simplistic and as minimalistic as possible don't overdo it with videos like this i like doing them i don't want to say little effort but i don't want to go all crazy with the editing keep it simple pure and raw that's what people like that's what's been working for me all right so this is how i have my gopro mounted on my rear bumper have it with the gopro suction mount which i'll leave in the description nd filter gopro and this is how the shot looks facing right at the exhaust and let me show you guys a clip on what this angle looks like POV videos but you can also use the GoPro on short films that you're working on like for my case here in this shot you can see the GoPro mounted on the rear bumper and there goes another cabin view we actually clamped onto the harness bar that he had <laughs> and also another place that I like mounting my GoPro is here on the window have some cool shots of the rear or the front Also another good place where I mount is right here. Make sure you mount it to a flat surface otherwise you may risk of it falling off and it'll show the wheel when you're driving. Also if you want to hear some cool turbo noises you can always mount it front of the hood. Put it on the window and then it faces me as if I'm doing a vlog. But yeah, you guys can be really creative about your mounting locations on the rear back of the window. Again, all using my GoPro, no fancy microphones, just simply the built-in microphone. So another cool thing you can do, you can add the suction cup here to the trunk and then have the camera facing directly down if you guys can shoot flames that would be a really cool shot so that was it uh, i know that was a short video but again the purpose of this video was to show you guys how i make this video so you guys can make them as well don't forget to tag me on pov videos if you guys do make them i really want to watch some of these videos that you guys are going to be making super fun to interact again with others i really enjoy doing that tag me on social media and then i can repost your video until next time guys take care hopefully this fire stuff goes away very soon Catch you guys later. Peace out.